Declan Rice has played 889 minutes so far this season for West Ham United, with 439 in the Premier League, the most a teenager has featured for West Ham since junior Stanislas. For context, Rhys Burke played 415 minutes in the 2014-15 season and Rice overtook this when he was named man of match in a 1-1 draw at Wembley against Spurs in just his fourth Premier League start. But before we dig into the stats from that game, we're going to take a look and see how he has got on so far this season. Declan made his debut in last season's final fixture against Burnley as he came on in the closing stages of the game. But it was his second appearance that caught the eye when he replaced Mark Noble at Old Trafford on the opening day of this season, where 96% of his passes found a teammate and he contributed two interceptions. Rice currently makes the most interceptions at West Ham in the league per 90 minutes with 2.1 per game, just ahead of Obonna and Noble both on 1.9 but well ahead of James Collins. However, the Ginger Pelly sits top of clearances table with a massive 10.8 per game and is actually top in the Premier League when you only include players with 5 appearances or greater. Rice sits 5th just behind his fellow centre-backs. However, at this point it is worth noting that Rice has played a portion of his games in midfield and we will show another factor to consider in just a minute. But before that, another chart Rice sits top of is for blocks. This includes shots, crosses and passes where he makes 3.2 per 90 minutes and sits just ahead of Zabaleta on 3.1 with Noble and Masuaku a bit behind on 1.9. Our Argentinian right back does contribute the most tackles per game though with 3.2 and as we pointed out in our last video this is a stat which Obiang presses at as he sits second and perhaps surprisingly Masuaku sits third with 2.8. Rice is seventh in the squad in this category but is still ahead of the other four centre backs. Now on to the other stat which offsets Rice's clearances, his passing. While all the centre-backs at West Ham have an average pass length of over 22 metres, Rice sits at 17. This shows Declan's composure and ability to play the ball out from the back with a reluctance to play the long ball. He averages 32 passes per 90 minutes and 28 of those are considered to be a short pass. Declan also plays a lot less long balls than the other centre-backs as Collins plays 11.6 per game, Rice plays just 4.1 which is also 2.6 less than the next lowest in Ogbonna. West Ham have an average pass completion rate of 76.1% in the Premier League and Declan sits above that on 80%. Against Spurs, Declan had 44 touches, more than Reid and Ogbonna, and did more passes in the game than those two combined. He also contributed 15 defensive actions, once again more than his senior teammates in the back three. When you compare him to other youngsters in the Premier League, he excels once again. He has played the fifth most minutes for a teenager in the Premier League this season, making the second most appearances. We have taken all players that are currently 20 years old and younger, and only John Joe Kenny of Everton sits ahead of him for clearances with 4.5, and he sits third for the least dribble past, with two players ahead of him, Solanke and Abraham, both being strikers. He is second for most of his interceptions as Ollie Burke at West Brom fares better, but the 18-year-old is first for blocks, ahead of Maitland Miles at Arsenal. Stats are indicators, and when you bring all the ones we have shown you today together, they demonstrate the leadership, composure and commitment that Rice shows, as well as ability to read the game. Declan is a name known to West Ham fans, and a name non-West Ham fans should be looking out for. I've been Gio, thank you for watching. And to say thank you for watching the video, we at Hammers Chat are giving away a signed photo of Declan Rice. To enter, simply subscribe to the channel and comment below with what impresses you most about him so far.